Well, multifamily properties are really, really recession proof because what happens when the recession comes, people who are foreclosed on properties or homes, they have to go somewhere. So they turn to residence apartments. They go to A class apartments or B, B plus class because they've been living in single family home and so forth like that. And when the recession hits, if you cannot really give rents for A class, multifamily apartments, you go to the B class, lower rents, or people in the B class rent category go to the C class and C goes to C minus. So it's a progress down in recession, but everybody needs a place to live. So that's why multifamily properties are not really recession resistant or proof since any business that you know relies on rental income can go be affected in the very big economic downturn. However, multifamily properties tend to be more resilient, is the word, than other types of real estate investments like shopping centers or other things, strip malls, uh, office. Look at San Francisco now, 40% vacancy in offices, all those things can hurt quite a bit in the recession uh, due to the stability of rental income. In times of economic recession, tenants may be more likely to stay in their apartments due to affordability and the higher probability uh, of vacancy. Additionally, multifamily properties may also be superior in superior access to financing during a downturn. That's the other part also. And giving investors an opportunity to capitalize on the this necessary, you know, unnecessary or recessionary uh, environment, you are able to still pull out and still make good on in the, I know in the 2007 and eight, I've looked at many of the charts and everything. Lots of commercial sectors went 40% down, 60% down. You might already know of them, but multifamily went only 12 to 13% in certain areas, nothing even happened and senior, living, housing did not even go down in the recession. So a lot of people nowadays are really, myself included, very much into senior living, senior assisted living, memory care, things like that, because they are quite a bit recession proof because it's a need driven market with the seniors, 10,000 baby boomers turning into 65 every night in USA that gives recession proof kind of, you know, prerogative a choice for investing into assisted living, senior living also for a very good cause.